you doing out here, Petruccio? You should be in bed. I want those feathers. What for? It's a secret. If I get them for you, will you go back inside? Yes, I promise. Here, as promised. Grazie, brother. You still haven't told me why you want these. I will, in time. Claudia, how are you? Bene. You shouldn't keep things from me. It's Duccio. What of him? I think he's been unfaithful. Who told you this? The other girls. I thought they were my friends. Harpies. You're better off without them. I loved him. No, Claudia. You only thought you did. He should suffer for what he's done. Wait here. I'll go have a word with him. Nothing but the best for you, amore mio. But what of Claudia? I thought you'd been promised to her. The father said I could do much better than an auditore. Oh! Virbante! Come, let us walk a bit. What? I had something <laughs> else in mind. Oh, Duccio! Mm. Mm. Hey! 
Lurido porco! Ezio, my friend! Ah! Ma che ti piglia? You insult my sister. Parading around with this puttana. W what are you talking about? I saw the gift you gave her. Or the things you said. Maybe your sister shouldn't be so stingy with her virtù. You broke her heart. Ha! And now I'm going to break your face. You auditores all talk me. But when it comes time for action, ha! You regret ever opening your mouth. I could have taught your sister a great many things. She's lucky to have had someone like me. Bastardo! My sister! what my little gallery has got. I'm sure I have a sort of vision any art lover or sinner in need of another motion. That faithless husband of mine is cheating. I know it, as do all the neighbors. Please teach him a lesson for me. I give up! That bitch! <laughs> I mean, wonderful wife of mine! <laughs> I'll go home!
Get this to its destination fast, really fast. I'll pay you well. Noble prices for noble way. Mm. 
Buongiorno, Ezio. Buongiorno a voi, madre. Come state? Sto bene. And you? Still recovering from last night? I have no idea what you're talking about. Of course not. Anyway, I have an errand to run. I'd like you to join me. Con piacere. Come. It's not far from here. I know about your fight with Vieri. What fight? Per piacere. Let's not play this game. He spoke ill of us. I could not allow him to continue. I'm sure he's having a hard time dealing with the accusations against his father. Francesco di Pazzi is many things, and none of them good. But even I never suspected he'd be capable of murder will happen to him? I imagine there will be a trial. Will father speak at it? He'll have to. He's the one with the evidence. Still, I wish there was another way. You've nothing to fear. Everyone wants justice done. It is an unfortunate state of affairs, but it will pass. Here we are. Hello, Leonardo. Madonna Maria. This is my son, Ezio. Molto onorato. L'onore è mio. Let me go and fetch the paintings. I'll be right back. He's very talented. Imagino. Self-expression is vital to understanding and enjoying life. You should find an outlet. I have plenty of outlets. I meant besides vaginas. Mother. Back to your house then. Si, si. Ezio, help Leonardo, will you? So Ezio, what do you do? He's been working for his father.
You're to be a banker. For now. And you, Art, was it? Truth be told, it's been difficult for me to settle. Painting is nice, but I often feel like my work lacks, I don't know, a purpose. Does that make sense? I'd rather contribute more practically, more directly. Architecture, perhaps, or anatomy. I'm not content merely to capture the world. I want to change it. I have no doubt you'll go on to do great things. Vi ringrazio, Madonna. That's kind of you. Anch'io. Ezio, come in, son. I need these packages delivered to associates of mine in the city. I also need you to retrieve a message for me from a pigeon coop not too far from here. Va bene. I'll get it done. Come back here when you're finished. There are some things we need to discuss. And please, my son, stay out of trouble. Hmm? Giovanni's kid? No, idiota. He just happens to look exactly like the man. Give it here. Don't worry, boy. We're not contagious. At least I'm not. You're sick and wounded. <laughs> here, over here. Oh, I have a delivery from Giovanni Alatore? Yes. Were you followed? No. Why would I be followed? Give me the package. Tell your father that they're moving tonight. He should as well. Who's moving? What's going on here? Wait! Come back! Explain yourself!
Father? Federico! <gasps> Serezio! Thank God! What happened? Where is everyone? They took your father and brothers to the Palazzo della Signoria, to prison. And my mother, my sister. Ezio. Claudia. Are you all right? Yes, but mother... She's in shock. They... When she resisted... She... It's not safe here. Is there some place you can take them? Yes, yes, to my sisters. Good, do that. In the meantime, I'll go see my father. Be careful, Messer Ezio. The guards were looking for you as well. Ezio! Father! What's happened? Took a bit of a beating, but I'm all right. What of your mother and sister? Safe now. Aneta took them? Yes. Wait! You knew this would happen? 
Not the way he did, and not this soon. Doesn't matter now. What do you mean? Explain! There's no time. Listen closely. Return to the house. In my office is a hidden door. Use your talent to find it. Beyond lies a chest. Take everything you find inside. Much of it may seem strange to you, but all of it is important. Do you understand? Yes. Good. Among the contents is a letter, and with it some documents. I need you to take these documents to Mr. Roberto. He was with me in the office this morning. The Gonfalonieri, I remember. Now please, tell me what's happening. Are the Pazzi behind this? There was a note for you at the pigeon. It said, go, Ezio. Go now. For the road patrols and city reserves. Why serve with mercenary commissary when we could uphold the honor of the Republic? Whoa, it's a noble way to do it. Father said there was a door here. Messer Roberto. With the swords, aren't you supposed to arrest me? No. There he is. What do you want then? For you to die. Santa Maria Novella. Go. There he is.
Ezio Auditore? What are you doing here at this hour? It... I, I don't... Wait, child. Take a breath. Collect your thoughts. My father and brothers have been imprisoned. I was told to bring you this. Ah. I see now. It's a misunderstanding, Ezio. I'll clear everything up. How? The documents you've given me contain evidence of a conspiracy against your family and against the city. I'll present these papers at their hearing in the morning and they'll be released. Thank you, Signore. Of course, my child. Do you need a place to stay? You're more than welcome here. No, grazie. I'll meet you at the piazza. Don't worry, Ezio. Everything is going to be fine. the city's buildings for sport, while not illegal Giovanni Auditore, you and your accomplices stand accused of the crime of treason. Have you any evidence to counter this charge? Yes, the documents that were delivered to you last night. I'm afraid I know nothing of these documents. He's lying! I need to get closer. In the absence of any compelling evidence to the contrary, I am bound to pronounce you guilty. You and your collaborators are hereby sentenced to death. You are a traitor, Roberto, and one of them. You may take our lives this day, but we will have yours in return. I swear we will! Father! Hey! Grab the boy! He's one of them! I'll kill you for what you've done! Guards! Arrest him! Abba Tetel. Better run, boy. Fast.
I've got a little request for you. I've identified several strange markings that I've discovered right across Renaissance Italy. Now, I don't know what they're doing there, but I want you to help me find out. Rebecca has marked their general location in the database with an eye icon, and she's made them glow as well. Keep an eye out. Serezio, thank God. I've been looking everywhere for you. I, I couldn't stop them, Annetta. I tried, I swear. But there were so many guards. Please, come with me. We need to get you off the streets. What of my mother and sister? They're safe. I'll bring you to them. No, it's too dangerous for us to travel together. Tell me where to go and I'll meet you there. My sister's house, just north of the Duomo. I'm on my way. Another capering crusade. I'm not going to you! There! Somehow fight. Ah! <laughs> 
better for now. But prevention is the best cure, I always say. I've done what I could. But perhaps you should avoid the deeds as well. It's not possible. This can't be. Hold on. That's computer code. Let me compile it. To... Oh, shit. It's an encrypted file. Upload it to my computer. I'm a master at decryption. I can't. It's only compatible with the Animus itself. I'd upload it to Desmond, then. I can't believe this. Hello, this is... Uh, they, they call me Subject 16. Listen, I don't have much time. There's something I have to show you. We have been lied to this whole time. Everything we know, everything we've been brought up to believe, <laughs> it's wrong. Okay, um, I've uploaded the evidence, the file that, 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 that proves it all. But I've split it into 20 pieces and locked each with a code. Oh, can't be too careful. Qu Queen Isabella. No, not her. Uh, 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 what century is it? Uh, 
Never mind. I've hidden the code to the first file inside this program. Find it. Find them all. And along... This is... They, they, they call me Subject 16. Listen, I don't have much time. There's something I have to show you. We have been lied to this whole time. Everything we know, everything we've been brought up to believe, it's wrong. Okay, um, I've uploaded the evidence, the file that, 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 that proves it all. But I've split it into 20 pieces and locked each with a code. <laughs> Can't be too careful. Qu Queen Isabella. No, not her. Uh, 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 what century is it? Uh, never mind. I've hidden the code to the first file inside this program. <sighs> Find it. Find them all. And along the way, you'll begin to see the truth. What the heck? How did this get inside our animus? Oh. Oh, the memory core. We transferred 16's memory data from Abstergo into the Animus 2.0. He must have hacked the machine when Vidic left him alone between sessions. Oh, hold on, wait a second. The signs on the walls in Abstergo... The ones written in blood. Those were clues. He was telling us to look for them inside the Animus. We have the wrong building. No. No, this is it. It is a pleasure to make your acquaintance, Messer Ezio. Annetta speaks quite highly of you. I can see why. I appreciate the kind words, Madonna. Ti prego. Call me Paola. Thank you for offering your home to my family, Paola. It was the least I could do. You must be tired. Perhaps you'd... No, grazie. I can't stay. Why? Where are you going? To kill Uberto Alberti. I understand your desire for vengeance, but the Gonfaloniere is a powerful man. You are not a killer, Ezio. Spare me the lecture. But I can make you one. And why are you going to teach me how to kill? I'm not. I'm going to teach you how to survive. 
come. Discretion is paramount in my profession. We must walk the streets freely, seen but unseen. You two must learn to blend like us and become one with the city's crowds. My girls will show you how. You can practice with me anytime. Now that you've learned to blend, I'll show you how to use it for more than just moving around. Let's teach you how to steal. Thief! Thief! Once you've stolen from someone, Ezio, you mustn't linger. Leave once you've picked their pocket. 